What up, what up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today on Fitness Tech Reviews, we're gonna be going over the Honor Band 6 versus the Xiaomi Mi Band 5. Both these are relatively affordable, and of course, they're very popular on the fitness band market. So let's go ahead, go right into the review. Let's go into some of the similarities between these two bands. First off, they both have great AMOLED displays. Both of them are fairly bright, so you will be able to see them within bright conditions. Also, they do automatically track a lot of different exercises. Of course, those be in the running, walking, and cycling variety. Both of them have pretty much the same sensors, an accelerometer, a gyroscope, and a heart rate monitor, where actually the only thing different is the Honor Band 6 will actually trace your blood oxygen levels. Both of these bands can read off notifications from your text messages and emails, where the Honor Band does have a little bit more compatibility with your different social media pages. But they both have 2D glass, so they are very scratch resistant in that regard, and they're both five atmospheres of water resistance, so you can go swimming with both bands. Both bands are replaceable, so if you are looking for something a little bit more colorful around the wrist, you will have an option. I do see the Mi Band being a little bit more popular. Just due to the size of the Mi Band 6, there are a couple of watches that are pretty much the exact same sizes, so there will be more options for the Mi Band if you want different bands around your wrist. They both have Bluetooth 5.0, so very accurate in that regard. Also, both of these bands rock pretty much the same battery level. Even though the Honor Band 6 does have a little bit more battery capacity, they both can last anywhere from 10 to 14 days, counting on how many times you use it, and if you have continuous heart rate tracking and stuff like that on, which of course, this is a fitness channel, that's what we have on, so about 10 days is what you expect pretty much from both bands. They are both compatible with Android, although the Honor Band 6 will not be compatible with your iOS devices, the Mi Band will. Let's go ahead and get into the differences. Of course, you can see the Honor Band 6 does have a bigger screen at a 1.47, where the Mi Band has about a one inch display. So if you're looking for a bigger display, Honor Band 6 is where it's at. As far as activity tracking is, this is a fitness channel, activity and sleep tracking, the Mi Band 5 blows the Honor Band 6 out of the water. Way more accurate and pretty much all the metrics you can put in and it even does swim tracking as well so if you want to go swimming you can go swim tracking with the Mi Band 5 where the Honor Band 6 does not do that also you can get a pace with your running and with your swimming through the Mi Band 5 where the Honor Band does not do that and of course with sleep tracking as well the Mi Band is a lot more accurate even though you do get blood oxygen levels on the Honor Band 6, I saw the Mi Band 5 was a lot more accurate in that regard. But if you are looking for something very similar to the Mi Band 5, the Amazfit Band 5 actually does have an SPO2 sensor and Alexa built in. I'm gonna knock that review right up here. It's a little bit more of an improved Mi Band 5, so check that out if you're looking in between the two. And as far as the UI is concerned, they're pretty similar. The only real difference is there is a physical button on the Honor Band 6 where the actual Mi Band is a capacitive button on the bottom, but they both do the same home screen integration. Swiping down on both of them, the actual Honor Band will go into settings where when you swipe down on the Mi Band, this will go through your workouts and stuff like that. To do the same thing on the Honor Band, you will have to swipe to your right and to your left, it being a little different in that regard and notifications with the swipe down. And when you go, want to go to notifications for this one, you will be swiping to your right or to your left. And you will have also music integration with both of these as well. But they both have very good screens with magnetic charging at the back of them. And as you can tell, they are replaceable with the Mi Band being a little bit easier to replace. And it's a little bit more fidgety to get the Honor Band off. But they're both very good screens. And guys, I am a small YouTube channel. A subscription will go a long way and a smash of that like button will help out with that YouTube algorithm. So hopefully you join on in with my YouTube career as well. As far as my recommendations are concerned, the only way I would choose the Honor Band 6 over the Mi Band 5 if you are just looking for smartwatch features. If you're looking for better notifications, the Honor Band 6 is going to be where it's at. Even though you actually can check 
calls on the Mi Band 5, like actually it doesn't have a microphone on it, but you can actually swipe away calls where you can on the Honor Band 6, but the Honor Band 6 just has the bigger display and it has more integration with all your social media pages. But for pretty much everything else, the smaller screen might be a little bit less appealing for you, but as far as the heart rate tracking, the workout tracking is concerned, the Mi Band 5 is where it's at with your sleep tracking. If you want to go swimming, all this is built into the Mi Band 5 where they pretty much have the same battery as well. The only other thing I will consider is the Amazfit Band 5. It's pretty much the same exact band. Check out my comparisons right up here of the two bands. And the only thing it adds in is it does add in its SPO2 sensor and it adds in Alexa integration. So you can actually swipe to your right, you can call Alexa to ask it a bunch of questions. It doesn't have a speaker on it, so you will have to read it, but it's a nice little added feature to help you guys out. But other than that, guys, stay happy, stay healthy, and above all, stay positive. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.